patriarch Moran Mor Ignatius Zaka Iwas I was the 122nd successor of St. Peter in the Apostolic See of Antioch. He was born on 21st April 1933 in Mosul, Iraq in the Iwas family. His parents named him St. Neherib in memory of the ancient Syrian ruler, father of St. Behnam. St. Neherib was the fourth son among seven children. Bashir Iwas, father of St. Neherib, who had graduated from the university in Istanbul, was a professor in the military engineering college. After a few years of teaching, Bashir moved to Iraq and started a woodworking factory. Young Senaharib lost his father when he was 10 years old and his mother when he was 12 years of age. The loss of his parents made a deep impact on Senaharib and after deep contemplation, he felt the calling of God and decided to pursue a life dedicated to the Lord. At the age of 13, in 1946, Senaharib became a student at St. Ephraim Monastery while doing his secular studies at the Holy Virgin Mary's and the St. Thomas Syrian Orthodox Church School in Mosul. At the seminary, he was called Zaka and on 28 November 1948, he was ordained a Kuroyo by His Excellency Mor Atanasios Thauma Kasir and on 8 February 1953, he was ordained Alphodiakno by His Excellency Mor Gregorios Paulos Behena. On 6 June 1954, Zaka was ordained Ramban by His Grace Mor Gregorios Paulos Behena. After graduation, Ramban Zaka taught Syriac and the Holy Bible at St. Ephraim Monastery, Mosul. At that time, he was appointed secretary to the Patriarch of Antioch, Ignatius Afrim I Barsom. On 18th December 1955, he was promoted to the rank of full deacon by His Excellency Mor Divanasios Girges Behena. In 1957, Patriarch Ignatius Afrim I left for his heavenly abode and Mor Ignatius Jacob III succeeded him. On 17 November 1957, Patriarch Jacob III ordained Zaka Iwas a priest and he was appointed the secretary to Patriarch Jacob III. From 1960 to 1962, Ramban Zaka studied a pastoral theology and oriental languages at General Theological Seminary and also completed master's degree at New York University. In 1962 and 1963, Patriarch Jacob III delegated Ramban Zaka as observer at Second Vatican Council in Rome. On 17 November 1963, exactly six years after becoming a priest, he was ordained bishop by Patriarch Jacob III by name Mor Severius for the Diocese of Mosul. On 1 September 1964, Mor Severius Zaka discovered the holy relics of St. Thomas in the walls of the St. Thomas Cathedral, Mosul. A portion of the relics of St. Thomas the Apostle was given to Malankara in 1965 when Catholicus Mor Organ I paid a visit to the Patriarchate. A small portion was again presented to Mulanturati Martoman Church in 1994. In 1964, Mor Severius Zaka accompanied Patriarch Jacob III as his secretary on his visit to India to consecrate the new Catholicos Basilios organ. In 1969, Patriarch Jacob III appointed Bishop Severius Zaka as Archbishop of Baghdad and Basra, then of Middle Europe and Scandinavian countries in 1976 and of Australia in 1978. In October 1971, Archbishop Mor Severius Zaka accompanied Patriarch Jacob III on his visit to Pope John Paul VI at Vatican. When the first common declaration with the Roman Catholic Church was signed, Mor Severius Zaka has presented the Patriarch at various meetings with the Roman Catholic Church. The Patriarch was a great believer in ecumenical movement and reconciliation. On 23rd June 1984, 
Patriarch Zaka I and Pope John Paul signed the historic agreement for communion, bringing an end to the 1,500-year-old unfortunate division between the Roman Catholic Church and the Syrian Orthodox Church of Antioch, which occurred in the Council of Chalcedon in AD 451. More Severus Zaka was an honorary member of the Pro Oriente Vienna. He was a member of the Academy of Iraq Culture. He was elected to the Central Committee of the World Christian Council in 1975. His Holiness was the President of World Christian Council during the period of 1995 to 2006. Patriarch Yaakov III left for his heavenly abode on 25 June 1980. On 14 September 1980, Mor Severus Zaka Iwas was enthroned as the 122nd Patriarch of Antioch and all the East in which Catholicos his beatitude Mor Basilius Paulus II was the chief celebrant. In 1982, Patriarch Zaka made his first visit to India to partake in the Golden Jubilee Feast of his predecessor, St. Elias III, and travelled extensively throughout the state of Kerala. Patriarch Zaka I visited Malankara again in 2000, 2004, and in 2008. On 26 July 2002, Patriarch Zaka I consecrated Mor Divanasios Thomas Catholicos of India by name Basilius Thomas I. St. George Cathedral at Bab Thoma, Damascus and the Patriarchal Headquarters had many limitations in space. Keeping in view the expansion, in 1996, Patriarch Zaka I established St. Ephraim Seminary at Marat Sidnaya, Syria with Chapel, Synod Hall and other facilities. His Holiness has ordained more than 50 bishops during his patriarchal reign. There are many literary works done by His Holiness. Patriarch Ignatius Zaka I ruled as the supreme head of the Universal Syrian Orthodox Church for a long period of 33 and a half years, which exactly matches the length of our Lord's ministry on earth. Since 2013, the violence in Iraq and Syria grieved the Patriarch, especially the loss of life and property of the faithful in Syria, the abduction of bishops and the destruction of ancient Aramic villages of Malaula and Sadad. Patriarch Zaka was called to his heavenly abode during the Great Lent on 21st March 2014 while His Holiness was in Kiel, Germany, following a cardiac arrest. On 23rd March, his body was taken to the monastery of Mor Jakob of Sarug in Warburg, Germany. On 25th March, the body was shifted to Beirut, Lebanon, and on 27 March to the Patriarchal St. George Cathedral at Bab Thoma, Damascus, Syria. On 28 March, the body was entombed at the St. Peter's and St. Paul's Cathedral, Marat Sidanaya, Syria, in the place prepared by His Holiness, the late Patriarch Moran Mor Ignatius Zaka I Iwas. The feast of Patriarch Moran Zaka I is celebrated on 21st March.